have been asked what is going on with my hair what's on my iPhone so got my iPhone ready I'm quite organized with my iPhone if you look I just put everything in folders like straight away past all the boring stuff my first folder is shopping and I had to narrow this down a lot I had the eBay app and I had my new look app um, I had all the apps of the good shops that actually had their clothing on there so I have price runner it's my first app price runner is a really good app you just like you type in something like if I wanted like if I wanted a PlayStation I'd type in PlayStation and then it would come up everywhere you can buy it what its prices are so before you even like step foot outside the house and want to go look around and be like oh where can I find the cheapest place you can just look on here and it tells you automatically the cheapest place what else have I got store card now this is a really good idea if it worked store card if you look I'm going on it you've got like all your cards all your loyalty cards and everything oh that's it all on there so I've got Boots a restaurant called Brewers Bear um, LED a membership card because I like to keep fit and healthy um, Nando's mm, Nectar card Subway Superdrug Tesco's Toys R Us best shop but I thought the shop that should do it the most is Tesco's and you can't really do it in most Tesco's at the moment so I think it's a good idea in the future but it's made my purse a lot lighter so I don't really want to get rid of it but I suppose where any shops it doesn't work in you can always just tell them the number which will be on your phone anyway my next uh, file is O2 and I've got my O2 so I can keep track of all the calls and everything making sure I'm not costing myself too much money I've got O2 Wi-Fi I think it just gives me Wi-Fi I don't even, I've never clicked on that I've got O2 priority moments, but I just enter into the competitions and stuff in that I've never actually used any O2 priority moments. Next, I've got a folder called Lifestyle. Backgrounds. My background at the moment is just the starry one you start off with. I've got my bank, which I'm not going to show you. Ah, I've got this SkyMap app. SkyMap. Wait, is it called SkyMap? I don't know. But it's the coolest thing, right? Go outside, like in the middle of the night, and you go like this. So I almost dropped my phone on my head then. Go like this, and it shows you all the stars. I have a star above me, right? I have Mercury above me. Oh, the sun's there. Venus, Neptune, Mars. Different stars and everything, which I really like. I want to try and like learn all the stars and all the compilation constellations. I have iBooks. I did originally get iBooks to read Fifty Shades of Grey. I've got two books on here. Got Dracula. I've also got a book called Forty Eight Hours, which is actually quite good. I think I'm like halfway through at the moment. Like the whole book is just forty eight hours. It's really cool. Check it out. I've got Ballet Index, which yes. I do ballet, so I've just got like all French, I think it's French, all the French words and what they mean. Chasse, cheville, think, think, me, see so. Oh, I know that one. Class, oh, classical. Hmm. I have Shazam, which I think everyone knows what Shazam is. If you don't, it's like you hear a good tune, you put up, you put Shazam on, and you're like, listen, and it listens and it tells you what song it is. Um, I've never used it before. I always got it because everyone has it and it might come in handy one day, but I've never used it. I've got say no to 0870 when you've got to ring up 0800 numbers and stuff, any numbers that are going to cost you. And you type in the number to this app and it gives you the free alternative. Top notch, my friend. I've got the cloud app, which just gives me Wi Fi and more places again. And I've got quick scan, you know, them little barcodes. Next folder. I've got entertainment, I've got YouTube, 
obviously. Um, should we go on my YouTube account? <clears throat> I've got cat videos, prank videos, popular music videos, um, the best vines, Dad's Black. He's a funny find actually. Can you? Um, more vines, latest sport videos, everything wrong with Toy Story in 10 minutes. So I'll watch that later. Netflix, also my Netflix, last few things I have watched on Netflix. <coughs> <coughs> loading, oh, loading. Continue watching Breaking Bad, I've watched Aladdin, Tangled, Basically watched all Disney films that I can find on here. Then I've got Vine. I'm not really following a lot of people on Vine anymore because something happened to my phone and everything got wiped off. So I don't really have a lot of followers on. Followers? People on following on Vine. Episode time. Episode time is good. It's like any episodes that you watch tells you what series and what episode you're up to. I'm watching Breaking Bad and Once Upon a Time. I've got the William Hill and the Lab Brooks. <coughs> apps. They're the type of apps I've got in the World Cup, I was stuck on some bets in the World Cup thinking, oh, I know what I'm on about. And then like, each account has like a fiver left in it and I don't really want to touch it. Next one, social. Got WhatsApp, Snapchat, Facebook, Instagram, Skype, Fiber, Facebook Messenger and Twitter. I think they're all pretty obvious. You can follow me on all of them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Games. Here we go. Candy Crush. Obviously, I am on level oh, 123. I've got Magic Piano, which is like a little game, and like these little dots come down. It's like Guitar Hero, you've got to like hit the dots. Do, 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 do. Uh, Minesweeper, I actually love Minesweeper, and I'm really good at it as well. I think I'm really good at it, but I bet there's loads of you out there that are better than me. But I really like it. Tiny Towers, it's like a mini version of The Sims, but like in shops, you've got like get the stock and then they give you money and you can buy more levels of this tower and buy more shops and places. I really like it. It's like really old graphics as well which makes it more fun. Gin Rummy. It's like a card game. I haven't played on it in ages but it's a bit addictive. You play against a panda too and you can like make your little sim in it. <clears throat> doodle Jump. I think everyone knows what Doodle Jump is. Disney's Mickey Mouse Castle. I don't know if that's actually what it's called but it just says Castle. I only played that a couple of times, but that's loads of fun. I've got Cooking Fever, make myself some burgers. i got The Sims. I've got See It, Say It, but that might not be staying on here much longer because they never update it. I've got Crossy Roads. Crossy Roads is my game at the moment. That is my game. I mean, I am, I am hooked on that game. Amazing Brick, Amazing Brick and Amazing Wire. What's my score at Amazing Wire? These are like them games where they're like really old games, but they are the most addictive things ever. 70, that's alright. I'm proud of that. That's everything on my phone. I think I've downloaded anyway. There's not really a lot on my phone. I don't think I have a very big memory on my phone, but that's everything on my phone. Thank you for watching, and please like and subscribe, and check me out on some social networking stuff like Facebook and everything that I mentioned before, please. And thanks for watching. Bye! Look at this bottom of my head today.